Hello, my name is Stanley Parrish and welcome to my first tutorial. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to make a distressed texture and we're going to export that texture as a TIFF file with a transparent background to Illustrator. Okay, and just to show you, here's a um, here's two examples of what you can do with this effect. Uh, you see here, let me zoom out here. See how this t-shirt has a kind of worn out, uh, distressed look? That's the kind of look we're going for. All right, here's another one. And, uh, okay, so let's get started. Uh, right here, I created a new document. Size, 10 inches. Uh, you can make whatever size you want. Uh, first, we want to go to Filter. Render clouds. I'll just do it again. To repeat that, you can, you can just hit Control F or Command F if you're on the Mac. And just keep doing it until you get something you like. Okay, that looks good. Uh, next, you want to go to Image Adjustments Levels. Bring the right slider in some. Move the gray to the left. Okay, next you're going to go to filter, brush stroke, spatter. And I think I'm going to leave that. Spray ready is at 15 and smoothness at 1. Hit OK. Uh, next, we want to go to filter, texture, grain. And it looks pretty good. Just play around with it until you get something you like. Leave my intensity at 70. Contrast. Make the contrast about 45. Grain type, we can leave that at vertical. Okay, now what we're going to do, we're going to give this a little blur. So we're going to filter, blur, and blur. Alrighty. Next, what you want to do is go to image, mode, grayscale. This is very important because you have to you have to make your image grayscale before you make it a bitmap. So let's hit grayscale, discard, go back to image again, mode. And we're going to go to bitmap this time. Now we can. I'm just going to leave these at 72. And the method we're just going to use diffusion. Hit OK. pretty good. And then you want to save this as a TIFF file. So you go to File, Save As. Make sure you choose TIFF here as your format. And I'm just going to rename this to something like uh, Distress 01. Okay. Save that right to my desktop. Let's move on over to Illustrator. Okay, here I have a graphic uh, that I did earlier. It's just, just a simple design. So now we want to open up our TIFF file. So you go to File, Open. There's our texture that we made in Photoshop. And as you can see here um, in Illustrator, we can change this, even change the colors here. It's up to you. So I'm going to copy this. I'm 
just going to lay it right on top of my um, design here. Oh. I didn't copy. Go back. Now, there we go. I'm going to make this the same color as my background. And you can see now that we have that distressed look, uh, that worn out feel. Zoom in so you can get a better look here. Okay. <clears throat> what I'm going to do here, I'm just going to grab this and I'm going to duplicate it and move it over here on top of my shirt, my t shirt. I'm going to expand my graphic. group it together and now we just want to size it down to fit on the shirt right, there we have a simple design on the t-shirt has that uh, distressed look that we were looking for Stanley Parrish, uh, and thanks for watching.